This is your boy Donna Rollins, and you're watching 95.7 R&B. That was my impression of Wendy Williams. Too soon? <laughs> She might be hiding something inside that's gonna really hurt you one day. Ooh, look at God. It's all in my voice. How you doing, man? I'm glad to be back here, and I'm glad to see all the new modeling and remodeling that you've yeah. done in your studio. We spared no expense. Sir. Off air, we, 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 we came to the conclusion that this is the studio before you get fired. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, go in the no-name studio, but you're gainfully employed. I haven't been here in two years. You're gainfully employed. You're looking good, and you're still here, and you're still standing here, and I'm happy to be here with you again, brother. I understand you have a passion for cooking, man. Where did you develop a fondness for that? How Being broke. Started? Being broke. You know, like when I first started doing com when I first got into comedy, like you want to be able to take a woman on a nice date, a hundred and fifty dollar dinner, whatever. But when you only got twenty dollars in your pocket, you gotta know how to get that ten bag, right. ten pound bag of potato. You have to improvise. You got enough to get your dollar candles. Like me wanting to cook, it was out of trying to be romantic okay. on a budget. All right. And when I first started um getting into cooking, it was only to impress women. So what is your go-to dish, man? Valentine's Day is just around the corner. You entertain well, a lady. go-to, I mean, a sexy, a, a, a sexy, like, this is a good Valentine's Day a de a dish or meal. Deviled lobster tails with garlic noodles. With garlic? Garlic noodles. These garlic noodles I make are sexy. And they will bring out something in a woman. I what, This girl tried my garlic noodles one time, and everybody around her got upset. They thought she was trying to come on to me, because she was like, oh my God, if you knew everything that was going on all up in my mouth. You can't, you can't think of my food. She was like, she told me, I was like, she was like, the feeling is going all up in my mouth. And everybody's like, what you mean all up in my mouth? Yeah, you yeah, know? yeah. Hey man, I'm real. We almost caught your case, son. And, and all, back in August, you. Uh, old Zealous fan tried to take a photo of self of you in a restroom? Yeah, it wasn't me. I was with Chappelle that night. We, were, we had just started res residency at Radio City Music Hall. Yeah, yeah. And I'm, I engage my fans. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're never going to hear a story like Donnell didn't want to take a picture or he was being a diva or anything like that. Yeah. And it was a situation where we were leaving the hotel room and this guy came in the bathroom and he wanted to get a picture with Dave in the bathroom. I'm like, where, <laughs> Who does does? where did you get it? <laughs> yeah. So we out and I had a couple cocktails. I mean, it's the, it was cocktail hour. Right. You know, and the guy, and this is what I think, like, this was so upsetting about, we live in a world where everything needs, everybody wants to put everything on social media. Yeah. They want to be, you to be a part of their story. And we go outside, and the dude was like, he just started a Facebook Live situation, and you could tell he was trying to bait people. Yeah. And he baited me. You know, a couple of Hennessy's. When the rim is in your yeah. system. So, <laughs> and the Hennessy came out. And the Hennessy came out. <laughs> and he was like, hey, y'all, we out here. Blah, 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 blah. And, and, like, and like, we were like, chill. We were like, chill. And he was like, oh, then won't you get a breath? Like, you could tell. Like, he woke yeah. up like, I need more followers. Yeah. And, like, you know, Dave was one of my closest friends. Like, and, like I, I'm protective of him, the same way he is of me. And the guy, he just kept evading our space, and I just flipped out. The thing about it was, I took a swing at the dude, but I didn't hit. And people say, Donnell, you gotta stop trying to start fights if you're not gonna hit. I look like a ballerina dancer. Like, I'm just swing, like, whoop, whoop, whoop. You know what I'm saying? But I tell people, like, you ain't hit? I'm like, you know what? I'd rather be with, hang out with somebody that's gonna take a swing than not to swing. Yeah.